Hello, my warriors. How is it going? And welcome to another episode of Mech Warrior 5 Mercenaries Heroes of the Inner Sphere modded. We will hunt an assault mech or maybe a heavy mech today because, you know, we need bigger mechs to run our long tom that we have. And I want to try that out today. So let's see if we can find something. For that, we need money. For that, we need to play some more missions. This is a Demolition 32. We can definitely do that. This is Attack and Defend 32. Should we do it? I am not entirely sure. That's a raid 32. Yeah, um, I think we can we can play the demo. Let's go with the demo first, and then uh, we're gonna we're gonna continue. This is also one of those uh, storyline missions, kind of these flashpoints that we have here, and uh, they will give us extra rewards in the end if we continue to keep fighting them. That's what we're gonna be doing. So. Let's try to get to about, let's say, 10 million C-bills. And then we're gonna take a look around the stores to see if there's anything good. And for that reason, we're gonna take all the money. We're gonna take all the salvage that is available. And, hmm, we will certainly not take the Stalker here. I honestly want the Fire Starter to be on the board. But maybe it's just gonna be Inferno SRMs here. Uh, we'll take the Rifleman as our third mech. Uh, <clears throat> as the fourth mech? Sure, we'll do that. You are decent with ballistics, so I'm gonna pick you. Alright, Pikachu. Here we go. Should probably swap that out. Yeah, okay, so this is gonna be Dickens. Uh, because he's really good with ballistics. I think this makes more sense. Also, this guy is more evasive. The evasion on the blackjack is also pretty good. The rifleman has a little bit of armor. So I think that's gonna be alright. You're still mildly damaged. I did not repair you, I see. Ah, okay. Still want to do that. We didn't really take much damage in the last mission. So yeah, we have to wait eight days. That's fine. Not a big deal here. And we're gonna go in, we're gonna demolish the base, and then I don't know what's uh, coming afterwards. Let's see. Bergman's Planet 2. Let's do it. I chose the Inferno SRM Hunchback over the other one because these Inferno Reactor missiles deal online. good damage to structure. Sensors so uh, we can just use them. They're very weapons cold weapons online. to destroy whatever is in front of us or overheat anybody that tries well, to get to us. So no that's pretty good. Get in there and give him hell. I will give him hell like no one has ever given hell. Let's do it, guys. So this is one of those story missions that actually have pre-scripted attack ambushes, right? Right behind that hill, I believe, there is a lance of tanks waiting for us. Let's see if I am right. I think I am. Let's see. I think as soon as we come around the corner here, there will be a bunch of tanks attacking us. But we should be well suited to, you know, counter-attack them. Those are the lasers. That's the head laser. Sure. And... Tank attack! Nope. Oh. And... Tank attack! No, 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 no. Here they come. So we triggered a patrol. Let's do it, guys. Where are they? I don't see anything yet. Hmm. Suspicious. There's a tank. There are some VTOLs. That thing has to go. What? LRM Artemis Igor? What? So good. I love it. I love it that they have Igors with LRMs here as well. That's pretty cool. Yeah, new variants, guys. We need we need more things. We definitely need more different enemies to fight because you know, more variety is good. Haha, <laughs> that's pretty good. Can I shoot this already? Not really. Alright, let's go in. Get close. Nice kill there. I want you to handle the blackjack. I'm gonna go in here. I'll get him. I'm gonna try at the very least. What's that? Stinger? Machine guns. Ugh, nasty. Ooh, that's pretty good. Get him, boys. Get him. Let's go. Oh, he's... What? Headshot? How did he get destroyed so quickly? Whoa. Right, he should be shut down at this point. Easy prey. Yeah, yeah, you can get him, guys. I'm gonna go here already. So that's what I'm talking about. We're just gonna shoot whatever we can to get into the base and destroy it. Should not run through these pipes. Not at all, because they will explode. 
So I'm gonna leave the fun for my friendlies. They can deal with whatever is there. And we're gonna destroy that building here. Actually, what happens if I destroy those walls? Ah, that's just 1%. It's not really that great. Oh, 48, let's go, guys. I need to also cool down a little bit. We have flyers coming. Let's take them down. That was important. There's another one! Ah! It's Igor time. Wait, did he just have a PPC? Uh oh, uh oh. Alright, let's go back to cockpit. Ah, I'm panicking. I'm pressing the wrong buttons. <laughs> I want to press V, but I pressed B accidentally. Alright, here we go. Let's go, Irby. Alright, we got him. At this point, I think we actually have to deal with the herbs. Alright, Irby is all, almost down. And we have 27%. 25%. Did they change the, the mission type here? Because I have the feeling that those guys are bringing more and more enemies in a very quick succession here. Oh, Spidey. Hmm. All right, killing him. He still has his um, small laser. All right, we're gonna get your Irby. There is one of the marked tanks. Oh no! Ah, that dealt damage to us. I didn't see him going explode there. Anyway, we are basically done. We could get out of here if we wanted to. And I think I want to. Nice kill. Cool, 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 guys. Let's run. That was a nice, nice brawly start to all of this. And I think he got a tank there, right? Yeah, this SRM or LRM carrier, whatever it was, is destroyed. Let's get out of here, guys. This is a more dangerous mission than I thought it would be. But uh, honestly... I didn't have to take that last damage there with the explosion. I just didn't see it. I was too focused on, you know, getting to the buildings again. Target acquired. Target destroyed. And there's Rihanna. Let's get out of here. Hashtag quick mission, I would say. And it actually bears good money. I cannot wait to actually go to um, to uh, in industrial hub to see what's on the market. And again, ideally, we're gonna try to find ourselves no an assault mech with a ballistic hardpoint. We need 30 here, tons for the long term, plus ammunition, plus some cooling, and ideally, ideally, I would say, we're also gonna try to take some backup energy weapons. Ah, oh, that's a lot of tonnage, actually. Which mech could run that reliably? I mean, an Atlas could, but barely. So, LRM-20 Artemis, I love it. I'll take a PPC as well, and I think I'll take a medium laser. It has a double heat sink. Hmm. So we drop the peep, I'll take the double, and we're gonna go home. Alright. Let's keep going, guys. Where is the next part of this mission? Maybe it's that here already. It's a Raid 32. Um, sure. Let's go ahead and do that. Gonna repair that guy. Yeah, we didn't lose anything, so let's go up here, play the raid. There's also a defense contract 58 is a thing that we can play. Yeah, absolutely. So let's stay on this planet for a while, play two missions here, and uh, use the stalker again to defend. Because the missiles there are actually quite good. I'm even half tempted to drop the LRMs that we have and uh, get an LRM-20 Artemis in that we just got. Hmm. Anyway, we'll start with the raid. Sure. Um, so the picks are not the greatest here. We can take some money. Do we just get all the money? And leave it at three picks? I, I think that's it. And it's kind of bugging me that that is the best way to get better mechs. Just grind money. End of story. It's not good. Um, so we're playing a raid. Mm, it's a hot map, but those guys are not even in that big of a problematic situation. No, we will play that. Just as it is, with our lands that we have here. 
Alrighty, let's do it. The 41st Avalon Hussars are making a hard push into Draconis controlled planets. We'll let the official curator Ooh, small forces map. them head on. All right. In the meantime, we're tasked with going behind their front line. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Small map means that there is a lot of, uh, there's a big chance that we trigger everything at the same time. So brace for impact. Just walk up to it in order to pick it up. All right. Thank you, Rihanna, for letting me know. Almost didn't see it. That's close enough. Come on, give me something good. I would love to get a higher tier weapon. Alright, let's see. So when you take a look at the Rihanna space right now, it says 99,000 C builds. Solid. Another one? Oh, don't mind if I do. Alright. I'll take another one. And it is... Oh, it's like finding, uh, like opening Kinder Surprise eggs. You never know what's in there. Low C builds, but a large pulse laser tier three. Interesting weapon. Yeah, you go ahead and deal with him. Would you? Would you please do that? Um, I think they can. They can certainly, certainly deal with him. Mm. Mm. I um. Oh God. How do we do this? Target eliminated. I want you to attack the Phoenix Arc. Can you? From here? Just use high ground? It's out of range, of course. Ah, and that Phoenix Arc has a large laser. He actually has the range advantage. I'm gonna drop. I am not afraid of a Phoenix Arc. Alright, here we go. Because we have those guys. Boop. The missiles. Since we are in a hot environment, it's not a big deal. So, take the ground mover. Because the hawk is hot anyway. Uh, that was not head. That was weird. Oh, they are sending in more. Alright, 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 alright. Are we fine? There is a thing coming up. Hey, Phoenix. That was you. You tell, I would say. Okay, Harasser, good to know. We have the thing that we have to destroy here. So we have that done. And now we're gonna wait for our friendlies to find the way down in here. <laughs> uh, and yeah, there's also the Scorpion. And the Light Mech. What's that? It's a Stinger. Ah, I should not. Should I? He's gonna come to me anyway. I I'm gonna go. Somebody with long range can deal with them. I don't care about it. So guys, follow me, please. I'm tall. Igor. Down goes the Igor. And there's another warrior. Perfect. So guys, let's keep going. Let's keep smashing. Let's not waste any time here because I want to get this done and I want to get out again. 300 meters. Can't start shooting. He doesn't need much. Come on, man. There we go. So we got the score. This here is going to be a little bit more difficult, I would say. Okay. I don't want to get hit by that AC-5. I will take it. <laughs> That's the third already. Very nice. Also, let's stay in motion. I think it's best to circle around Brilliant. that thing. So that you can stay in motion, maintain your evasion. Oh, this poor guy. Uh, we got him. And another... We should really get bigger enemies here. Where, where's my challenge, huh? Uh, let's go for... Okay. Maybe those are some bigger mechs. Yeah, they only bring wasps and stingers here. This is not fun. I mean, I didn't negotiate for salvage, but I wanna, I wanna be under pressure a bit more. And I think we're gonna do that. Please, large laser Igor. Are uh, we gonna be, uh, do that by just taking higher tier missions? On, oh, got him. Bam. All right, let's get in here. 
He's critical. We, we should not mess around with that. Not really. But that's the last part of the of the base here, I think. Yeah, we're done. We can go home. But there was something about um something something dropship, right? Rana told me that there are enemies nearby. And our rifleman is already fighting. Oh, Christian is what is he fighting? Tanks. That's it? <sighs> One medium mech. Yeah, whatever. I think we have to kill him before he gets into our bags and kills us. Oh, that's a little short. That's better. Ooh, PPC Igor. No, LRM Igor. He's down. That's the PPC Igor. Now he's down. Are you, are you shut down, buddy? Oh my god, what? Who's shooting me? <gasps> that guy! Okay. Let's go home, guys. That was painful. My arm is about to fall off. We lost a medium laser here. Oh no. But I think we made it. So at that point, I'm gonna say follow me, guys. Rifleman again took a bit of damage because it has a good damage output. Therefore, the return fire is massive. What, what is this here? What? That's crazy. Guys, you need to work on your hiding spots because I'm finding all of them right now. <laughs> Alright. I mean, I'll take it. It's pretty good. Yeah, let's start engaging. I'm not in optimal range, but it's good enough anyway. And Stingers have nothing. No armor, no nothing. They're also pretty slow, actually. So, let's let's go home. That was that was a good mission. And I honestly like the Hunchback. It's good in terms of heat management. It can overheat enemies. The raw damage only comes from the five medium lasers that it has. But it's okay. It's a tool more than a weapon here. Alright. So... Now we're gonna take the higher rated mission and we're gonna bring our Stalker. I think it was a defense mission in the 50-ish bracket. And that should give us some good opportunities to maybe even find another heavy mech. Kind of upgrading our lands. And we got a large pulse, we got a PPC and we got some SRM ammo as well as about 3 million C bills. Obviously we cannot really pick anything here, but that's fine. Medium laser tier 2. I mean we just lost one. All right, I'll take that. Yep. Let's go with it. And... Hey, we got a spider and an autocannon 10 burst fire and then SRM6. That's pretty good. That is actually very nice of you. Thank you. Uh, Shugo Yamaguchi, right? That's him. Anyway, um, that was done. Now, we're gonna repair our max because we have to. It's a lot of repair time and cost. Hmm. I think it's still a good idea. Yeah, it's fine. I think we are not even running that thing here. Maybe. We'll see. So, uh, Spiderling. I don't care about that Spiderling. It's just money for me. We have 12 million Seabills, guys. And I think after we are done with the mission that's about to come, we can take a look around in an industrial hub and see if there's anything good to get. We get another 3 million from here. Maybe more loot is good. It's 58, guys. Keep that in mind. Uh, we can only take 5 total. I will take 22. That might be another mech that's worth 2 million. Plus something. Sure, I'll do it. So, defense contract means stalker. It's going to affect visibility for you. Medium laser, hunchback, and then the rest of them, you know, are just here. Okay, let's go. 10 days for repair. We're gonna dive in. And I'm looking very, very much forward to our shopping tour that's about to happen. I also need to check out new weapon systems. But I think we are kind of bound to the long term right now. That thing needs to be tested out on the battlefield. So here we are, These protecting the garrison like a boss. For 
Oh, did you see the hunchback just started, accelerated, and then he was like, oh, there's, there's a part of the base that I'm supposed to protect, so I better stop here, and then he turned around. So they actually have a bit of a better uh, movement doctrine now. Nothing on scopes at the moment, but don't get comfortable. Hostiles have been reported in the area. Yeah. So far, that's just tanks. I want something bigger, guys. As per usual. Alright, guys. Stay with me. Moving to your six, Commander. Just stay with me. We're gonna wait for them to come. We will arrive soon enough. Don't worry about it. I want to have them on my sensors and tickle them with my LRMs before we do anything else. Um, yeah, this hill is a bit of a problem. Enemies might spawn behind it and will not be able to get around. Target acquired. That's good. Let's go. A little bit of damage. The rifleman will be able to follow up on that. Correct. Oh, we are doing it. Alright. So, we're gonna push a slightly ahead of the base. Because I don't want to dispatch too much from it. Because enemies might just spawn behind us then. And uh, we'll be in the base directly. So the spawn is determined based on our position, not on the base position. No hit? What? Let's destroy all of those things. Alright, cool. So back to base. Let's see what's happening. No, wait. We only killed three of them. Weren't there four? Not sure. My friendlies are confused. On the approach. Ah, there we go. They're coming now. And the right us. behind us, as I was saying. Alright, let's see if we can attract a quick draw without destroying our own base. And there's another guy right next to me. Yeah, I'll stay on the quick draw. It is technically a heavy mech. Not really the heavy that I was looking for, but okay. Hey, quickie. Come over here. Acquired. Not really what I want. Let's stay on target though. Oh, I hear auto cannons. That's good. Oh wait, it's our auto cannons. That's our auto cannon fives coming from the waifu man. Can we kill that thing? I mean, I need to really, really swivel over to another target. Okay, I'm gonna leave it to my friends. That's a freaking Orion! Okay. Okay, okay, that's a problem, actually. Can't rely on my teammates here. It's crazy. I try to try... Try to try? Yeah, I try to try to hit his center and uh, headshot most of the time. Ah, it's a Wolvie. Got it. You know what? You take care of the Wolvie. This guy is still alive, and it shouldn't be. It's crazy. Alright, we got him. Now back to the Wolvie. I mean, I wanted a bigger challenge, but... I also want my friends to do the right thing in the right moment. What is going on here? Can we quickly kill that thing? Is that possible, guys? We got him. Alright. So, we got a third of the mission done. My mech is actually quite damaged already, which shouldn't be. Hmm. Alright. I mean, honestly, I, I was showing my back against uh, Wolverine for a long time there. Shouldn't have done that, maybe. Certainly. Thought there was a flyer. Oh, there it is. Hi. Those on radar. Okay, guys, Target let's go for wide. the Vindicator first. Got some LRMs to shoot him down. Let's see if that's enough. Between me and our rifleman, we should be able to kill that thing quickly, depending on our aim and accuracy. Down he goes. Nope, not quite. There we go. Got him. I will turn around. I think my friends have it covered. I hope so. Try to get that medium laser guy here. I love that stalker. My target eliminated. And we got him. So, last guy is another stinger. Hmm, too close. Alright, we cannot even shoot him. 
So I guess it's laser time. There we go. Half done, guys. After that, it's shopping time. We have 85% of the garrison still intact. That's that's good enough. Yeah, I'm sorry for your crops. Just gonna give it a tender massage, okay? With our mech legs. Alright, let's keep track of what's going on here. That guy's down. I am uh, honestly still a little bit baffled by the mechs that they are sending at us. It's just light mechs. That one occasional heavy being the quick draw. It's just lights and mediums. I mean, a nice wolf pack and a swarm of mechs can actually hurt me a lot. But they are no real match to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't need that warehouse anyway. And I have the feeling that my AI pilots are so confused with what's going on. I have the feeling that they are not really dealing any damage here. This location wasn't built to withstand military grade weapon fire. Come on, we let's get him. The there we go. No. Now we got him. Alright. A few more like I'm on a shooting range than in a real mech fight. And he's behind us, by the way. That's not good. Alright, we'll turn around. That's a kill. Ooh, and that's a javelin. At the same time, I am the one taking all the damage here. Seriously, my stalker is done. And that's because my friendlies are not firing often enough. It means I am the one that deals the damage, so I'm the one attracting the fire. Not good. Alright. Good, got him. Okay, what do we have here? Another one of those. Got it. Honestly, I think it's a good idea to just lag those dudes. And then stay away from him, use our range advantage. That should be it. And one more. There we go, so five enemies. It's gonna be a mix of VTOLs and mechs, I guess. Yep, they are the VTOLs. We have three of them. Two Igors, one warrior. Gotta take care of them quickly. And then there will be two mechs coming down as well. I hope that they will attack the base so I can take them out quickly, one by one, without taking any damage. Uh, it seems like it. Very good. Nice. Very good shot. I'm impressed, Mr. Blackjack. And here come the mechs. <gasps> the mech! It's a banshee. Alright, and then something else. I mean... We didn't negotiate for salvage anyway, right? Ammo low. Ooh, we are actually grinding through our ammo. Interesting. Zap. And here we go, medium lasers. Come on. I know. And that's it. Nope. That's it. There we go. Uh, heat management on the mech, by the way, is extremely good. I'll take that auto cannon off of you. Maybe I should take the mech off of you. Yep. Go away. Take my friends. Leave me alone, please. Alright, auto cannon down. He has a large laser still. Come on, hunchback. Get in his back. <laughs> Gotta grind through his front then. Alrighty, so our stalker is messed up. But it's still intact. And uh, we can repair that. Yeah, honestly, it was just the sheer amount of enemies that set us under pressure. Lots of SRMs on the board here. But um, I think we dealt with the Banshee quite nicely. So let's see what we actually can get in the shop. I want to bring the long term. I don't think it's going to be good, but we have to do it for science, so that you can determine if you want to buy a long term whenever you see it. Uh, we actually got some uh, salvage. I forgot about it. Interesting. We cannot take the Orion, sadly. Would love to take it. But an Enforcer is an option. That large laser is a pretty good one. That's a good medium laser. 
And I think I'll take a tier 2 as well. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. There are some doubles, though. So if I take them, I don't have to buy them, correct? Do I care about the Enforcer? It's money for me. But not buying double heat sinks is also money for me. Sure, I'll do it like that. Yeah, okay, I'll take a PPC or two, and then we will take, I don't know, another medium laser tier two. Got it. Let's get the hell out of here. We have 30 million Seabills. That is, in my books, definitely worth an assault mag. We go to Marduk. Marduk, isn't that a metal band? I think it is. Let's do it. So I hope we can find something good here, and I try to go a little bit more to the center of the uh, inner sphere, because uh, in the center, the overall difficulty is, I think, supposedly a bit higher, and you find better stuff in the stores there. We have some cantina options here. Let's go. Let's take a look at that first. Machine guns for a Centurion, auto cannon for a Vindicator, uh, sorry, a Vulcan. I think I'd rather try to destroy Vindicators and Urban Max. You will always find Urban Max. We'll accept this mission. LRM, Snow, J. Edgar? Sure, they are everywhere. Egoas are easy because you only have to destroy f uh, three of them. We'll take it and we'll see a lot of them. Alrighty, let's take a look at the mech market. Hatamoto G. Interesting. Not good, but interesting. 64 kph assault mech. Two missile, two energy hard points. So you gotta get big weapons on the guy. No, I don't think it's good. It's technically an assault mech, it's what I was asking for, but it's not good. It's not what we need. Alright, tier 47. We should um, actually kick some of our pilots out of here. Like Darby, dismiss pilot. Like Portillo, dismiss pilot. We're gonna hire some other guys and girls. Affirmative, Commander. Yeah, they're already coming with a very high skill set. With 32 skill points, it's just amazing. In our tier right now. So we're gonna pick up the two of them. Alright, uh, that being said, there's nothing interesting here. But there's a rare mech. Um, gonna start our repairs here. Yep. Let's take a look around. I hope this works. I hope that we are not spending all of our money just traveling and not finding anything. It's kind of the bane of a, of a mech warrior. When you really want to have one specific thing and have to grind through your sea bills to get it and then you're standing there not having the money to buy it anymore. So let's check it out. It's an awesome. Nope. Again, it's an okay mech, but nope. Catapult C, uh, sorry, K2. Also, it's, it's a pretty good mech to have. I like it. You could build something with it. It's a nice 65 toner. It would be a heavy mech that we would add to our lands, but I think I'd rather... Honestly, I'd rather have an awesome in that lands, running four PPCs and just double heat sinks. Imagine that. It's very slow, though. This guy, at the very least, runs 64 kph. But we can take it for something like... Um, defense missions, raids... Uh, not raids, but uh, war zones. Four PPCs. How much damage is a PPC? Ten, right? That is an arrow. Twenty damage. Cannot be intercepted by AMS. Minimum range 300 meters. Very long range, high AOE damage. 20 meters, meter radius. It's another way to test out a new thing. We can slap an arrow on the stalker easily. I need to try it. A buy an arrow. One, because 15 tons is so much. Binary lasers are also interesting. We have some more infernos. RP-10 solid is a thing that I should probably just pick up for the rifleman, or in general. Um, cemetery rifles are also pretty fun, but not right now. Dead fire SRMs, tag barrage.
What? No way. Yes, thank you. Yes, thank you. I'll take both. Oh, God. <laughs> Alright, we'll take arrow ammo. One arrow ammo bin is 70 rounds. Wait a second. Are you saying that I need, like... I'll buy a bit extra. They are very, very cheap. Um, That cannot be right. 70 arrow rounds. Alright, I'll check it out. I don't trust this, but I'll check it out. And I will certainly build an arrow into my stalker now. <laughs> Let's go. Let's do it, guys. Take out the 15, take out the 10, take out the ammo. We need an arrow. Bam. And, hmm. I think heat-wise, we can get rid of one of those things, right? Take one and a half ton of arrow ammo. And be good with it. That's it. We have an arrow, I guess. All right, guys. 30 days work. Let's do it. Also, a uh, fire starter. How much is it to repair you? Probably a lot. Half a million. It's not too bad. See, the thing is, I wanted to check out those, what are they called? Chain cannons. They seem fun. 600 rounds. Ah, they are not as great as uh, machine guns. Interesting. Have a better maximum range, though. So they have a very high rate of fire. They deal two damage. Seems good. Ah, uh, they are not hit scan. They are actual projectiles that you have to lead with. Interesting. Chain cannons. So they are close range brawl weapons. We need an ember or so for, with uh, four ballistic hard points on the fast mech. So I guess right now we are not using the fire starter. Hmm. I can think about therm uh, yeah, thermal cutters here. It's 120 meters. They are very, very light. Deal one damage and heat damage. Interesting for a build like that. So let's compare it to a flamer. Heat damage is 0 0.5. This is 0 0.3. Raw damage is 2. This is 1. How does it work? They don't have a rate of fire. I don't see it. It reaches a bit further, but that's it. Yeah, I'm not doing it. Um, alrighty, guys. We're gonna take a look at the arrow. Because I want to know how it plays. So we're gonna try to find a mission that we can do. A troll, no. Attack and defend, no. Give me, give me something quick, something good. Attack and defend. Patrol. There's a raid. What about that? It's another attack and defend. There are so many raids here. So if that doesn't work, we have a problem. That's the thing. Therefore, I want something that I can uh, play quickly. That's a thing. We have a demolition mission with an arrow 4. I think that is exactly what we're going to be doing. We're going to find ourselves a nice hill. And we're going to drop the arrow into the base all the time. Let's do it, guys. Oh, boy. I'm excited. I hope it works like I think it would work. Oh, God. So, Demolition 42, we can definitely do that. We will take some salvage shit. No, actually, let's take some money shares here. Sure, that's good. We have 230 tons, which means we are over tonnage. It's going to affect visibility and sensors. Alrighty. So, I think this is how we play it. Let's do it. Playing demo with a stalker. Oh. I hope it works, guys. I hope it works. Oh, I wanted the tech barrage as well. But now it's a bit too late to actually put that in the mech. We're gonna figure it out next time, okay? So the barrage tag has a pretty, pretty long cooldown. Um, it only shoots four times per minute. So a little bit more than every 10 seconds. And then it drops a barrage template somewhere, I guess. And with the arrow and two of those, we can just lay so much indirect fire. It's not good, because it's all gonna be splash. Hey, let's see. I'm kind of the more, you know, direct fire guy, as you might know. 
Be sure oh, to hell yeah. Any pipes or tanks, as the contents have the potential of being explosive. Four, five shots. Uh huh. It shoots five arrows? No. No, the damage is. Is it split? I mean, it's not quite an arrow what we are firing here. Not really. So they made it so... Ah, I know. I know what's, what's going on. It, this is a workaround because there is no single missile launcher in this game. So they took the base value or the base animation and everything of an LRM-5 to simulate an arrow. That's why we have five projectiles. They're operating at reduced efficiency. Keep on smashing. Okay. I can keep on smashing. I want to I want to see if I can do it like that with just artillery. And by the way, rate of, rate of fire is pretty good as well. Uh, I should probably go in. If only we had better sight here. Then I could actually see where I have to aim. But we are dealing damage for sure. And I think ammo-wise, we definitely need more. Now that I know that we have five shots per attack, it's not great. Let's actually try it against some enemies, all right? All right, let's go in. They also seem to be lock on Good to know. There it is. I'll leave the rest of the demolition job up to you, Commander. We destroyed the base down to 62%. Here, take an arrow to the knee. Uh, I mean, uh, it's splashy, but it's there. I am mildly impressed, I gotta say. Alright, I will shoot the tank as well, let's see. It doesn't do too much to the tank. I think this is really good against slow-moving targets. A bam Whoa! That's a lot of damage that I'm taking right now. Oh god. Um, yeah, there's a lot of stuff happening. Kill that real quick. It's not destroyed. There we go. Got him. Alright, let's turn around. Get the Jenner off the board. Because he's nasty as hell. Speaking like hell. Uh, speaking of hell here. There is more. And that pro uh, the, the thing that is more is, is heat. God, I cannot talk anymore. Brain fart! Enemies behind us, enemies in front of us. Frenzy's not doing things. Target identified. Uh, I'll deal with the Jenner. You deal with the Centurion, please. Alright, and now we can hopefully... No, arrows have a minimum range of 300 meters. It is not possible. Friendlies need to deal more damage, that's for sure. This is this is not gonna go well. Can I please get out of here? Friendlies! Would you please engage that Centurion? It's very much appreciated if you would. Oh gee. Ah, uh, that's a problem. Okay, got it. Arrow! What a boom! Uh this guy next, please. Minimum range is a problem here. Try to back up to 300. We need 300 meters. He's coming with us. Yeah. You've managed to demolish about half of the target's buildings. Crack on, Commander. Why is he moving in my direction? Stop moving in my direction. Anyway, Auto Cannon 20 is down. Because ammo is on the left side. Alright, where is the where's the light mech? Right behind us. It's already closed. All right, I'm gonna go for the jab here. Wait, was he running through his own base, destroying it? <laughs> it could have been. My target eliminated. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Right, we got him. Woo! That, my friends, was rough. All right, let's get into the base. Let's see what we can do here. We still have 30 uh, arrows. That's six shots. That's good to know. Uh, I'm gonna take the ramp here. Yeah, and we gotta get out of here again. So, to be fair, the space was not the biggest one in the world. What are you? 
You're down. All right. Those satellite emplacements, they give so much uh, destruction value. Yeah, very nice. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Definitely. My mech is done for again, and the rifleman took a lot of damage as well. Yeah, those enemies set us under pressure. Especially the hunchback. I was not aware that there's a hunchback. I thought the centurion was the one with the big ballistic shooting us to pieces. But no, I was wrong. I was totally wrong. Honestly, I want to see another mech. What do you think about the arrow? Is it good? Is it bad? I'm not sure. I don't like... I mean, I like the splash and I don't like it at the same time. It's a bit random and we can get criticals quite quickly. And the enemy's back armor will also be shred very, very quickly. So, I think it's a good support weapon, but nothing that... Actually, let's go. Uh, nothing that helps you uh, big time with destroying. It's nothing super precise, that's what I want to say. Let's go. Let's try again. Ah, uh, we lock. That was unfortunate. It was very, very unfortunate. Alright, let's go for the quick draw once more. Bam, bam, bam. Maybe two arrows? Maybe? I don't know. I don't see the arrow, guys. I don't see it. Ammo depleted. Alright, guys, let's get out of here. That was another test run. I just needed to know. Oh, God, we are even overheating. Alright, uh, let's get out of here. Let's go into the evac zone. This um, little encounter here just got us a little bit more repair costs, but I don't mind because I need to know for science. Yeah, let's go. Because I need to make an educated decision about if I want to have an arrow in my lance or if I don't want to have an arrow in my lance. <sighs> I'm on the fence. It's 15 tons. For 15 tons, I can have two LRM 15. Eh, not quite. Two LRM 15 is uh, 14. Let's say two tens and a bit of ammo. All right, I'll take an auto cannon. Nope, I'll take some medium lasers, because they are always good. Alright. And we're gonna get some payment. We have 12 million C bills. Our next goal is to find an assault mech and slap a long tom on it with a ballistic hardpoint. But that's a story for a different video, guys. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.